out, she had me do gratitudes. And I have to say, at first, I thought, why am I doing this? And, you know, it feels good. And I noticed after about two weeks of writing five gratitudes every day, my outlook started to change. I would go through my day and I'd start noticing, I'm grateful for this, I'm grateful, just little things. And it really affects your entire outlook and even the actions that you take because you're in such a grateful sort of state of mind. Mm. So. Love that. Um, Robert Fredrickson, who is a, um, is a researcher, she talks a lot about broad and build hypothesis, which is that the more you focus on positivity and gratitude, the broader your perspective becomes and you become a lot more efficient, effective, and creative thinker. Exactly. Right? So I just love that. It's fantastic. Yeah. Do you ever find yourself challenged to continue focusing on gratitude and positivity, or does the exercise always kind of keep you on task? Um, in general, um, no, I think I'm generally a mostly positive person. I think you have to be to be in this business. Um, but I will say that the gratitudes have definitely affected my performance in life. If you want to talk about the athlete mindset, um, I do notice myself taking riskier moves and anticipating things turning out in a more positive way from focusing on all the good. Mm. It's like you're attracting more good and you expect more good to come to you. Mm. When it rains, it pours, right? Yeah. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's pouring more positivity. Why is that? <laughs> it's actually focused on the positivity. Go for yeah. it. Yeah. Congratulations.